Hi everyone, so I get so many requests on this channel for weekly videos of my kitten and I haven't really done it because I know not all of you guys are interested in weekly videos on my kitten but I know that there's a group of you guys that really really want these kinds of videos, little cuddly videos with my little baby so I figured I would do an update video plus today's a really good day for an update video because he just got back from the groomer so he is looking so cute. Also, oh, I get requested all the time, or I get the question all the time, what am I calling him right now? Like, what's his name? Because I've gone through so many. So right now, his name is Pine Cone, Snow Cone, and sometimes just The Cone. But at the vet and the groomers, he's registered under Snow Cone. So I guess that's his official name. I just called him so many things. I was calling him Fish for a while, like the sign language Fish. I was calling him Winter. I've just like been trying out all these different names. None of them really fit until I found Snow Cone. Snow Cone really fits him because he's like pure white and he has those crystal blue eyes. He's such a cute little baby. And he went to the groomers for the very first time today. He got an oatmeal bath and a blowout. And he got these little um, caps put on his claws that I'm going to talk about that I think are a really like cool little idea. So I'm going to talk about those. But he is sleeping right now under my vanity. He's like worn out. He's like, Mom, this was so much stuff today. And the groomer said he was really, really easy to manage and that he was on his best behavior. So that was kind of cute. But I'm going to grab him and I'll be right back. So here's my baby boy. He's all groomed and he has a little red bow around his neck that I'm probably gonna take off actually after this video because it's probably irritating him, but I thought I'd keep it on just for the video. He looks so cute. They trimmed his ear hairs. Um, his ear hairs actually had gotten really long. See how they're all like the same length now? They were like out to here. Like I have no idea. I think it was a fashion statement because he can't hear so he was just growing hair out of there. They were like out to here. And when I walked in there, they were like, he has really long ear hair. And I was like, I know. Oh, and these are those cat things. Okay, so I know they're pink. I know my cat is a boy. I asked for blue. They did not have blue. They actually, the only color they had in his size was pink. So I didn't have an option, but I specifically asked them to check if they had blue, and they didn't have any in stock. So I was like, okay, if I have to get pink, I will. It will match his little nose, and yeah. So this is what the soft paws look like. And they're basically just these caps that go over the claws that keep them from being able to scratch up all your furniture. And they're completely safe. They're made specifically for cats. I did all my research online. I looked at reviews and they're completely safe. Even if the cat like chews it off and swallows it, it's non-toxic. And it's a really good alternative for declawing. So if you don't want to declaw your cat, either for moral reasons or because it's illegal, it's actually illegal in Los Angeles County. You can't declaw your cats here. So if you need like a good alternative, you can buy them online and do them yourself or my groomer place happened to do them. It was $20 for the front paws and I didn't do them on his back claws because he doesn't really scratch back there but he's been scratching on my furniture like crazy so I wanted to do something and he doesn't seem irritated with them at all. When I first brought him home he was kind of chewing on one of them like it was irritating him but then um, I kind of like looked at it and he just had like a piece of fur that was kind of glued wrong so I just pulled the little fur out and then he was fine. He hasn't been chewing on them or anything and online it says it lasts up to two months but my groomer actually said to get them replaced every six weeks. So cost wise even that's not that bad when you think that you're saving all of your furniture and your carpets and your walls and anything else that your animal might be scratching up because he seriously was scratching up everything but now he has these little like painted claw caps. I am going to request blue next time though because I kind of feel guilty and I thought blue would match his eyes. He already looks so girly and stuff I just wanted something very masculine on him but I guess painted nails aren't that masculine no matter what color it comes in so. To tell you the truth, he doesn't even look that different than he does when I took him in, other than he just smells really great. Like, whatever shampoo they used smells so good, but he kind of looks identical. Like, he didn't look that bad going in. Um, he wasn't, like, that shabby or ratty, but they definitely um, cut his ear hair down, put the soft claws on, and gave him a bath because he smells really good. There's, like, fur going through my room now. When my roommates from college were visiting me, we all went to Build-A-Bear. We got a commemorative memory Build-A-Bear so that we would remember this vacation together forever. And I actually picked this one out. This is a lamb, but it looks kind of like snow cone. It's, like, a little fluffy thing with a pink nose. So I was like, this is kind of cute. I don't know. It just, like, reminded me of it. So they actually ended up getting the same one, so we all got matching lambs, and we put different colors ribbons on them so that we could keep them apart the rest of the trip and their names are Lily, Daisy, and Lady. Mine's Lady and I think they're so cute. I actually put a lot less fluff in mine than they did because I wanted mine to be like really floppy and kind of like cuddly and I don't know. Actually, Snow Cone really likes these. They cuddle up together. If I can get a good picture of it, I'll take a picture of them together. But they cuddle up together and sleep together which I think is kind of cute because it's like really soft. It'd be like a good like baby present. Yeah, I thought that was kind of cute, but yeah. 
So that was just a really quick update. I just wanted to show him for all of you guys that have been requesting and talk about how his name is Snow Cone now. And maybe I'll do some more blog post updates on him as well. But I hope you guys have a great day. Video response me, videos with your animals that you love. And I'll see you guys later. Bye. Pinecone, you're sitting on a button that's making noise.